got a cat about a week and a half ago maybe and I haven't showed her in any videos or anything yet. This is Nutmeg. This is Nutmeg. Hello beautiful. Hello. Yeah. Are you having fun exploring? Do you like your father toy? We adopted a cat and her name is Nutmeg and she's not very happy with us right now so I can't show her. <laughs> but my best friend sent me a gift for Valentine's Day. Valentine's Day? Oh, it's only the best day of the year. Every February 13th, my lady friends and I leave our husbands and our boyfriends at home and we just come and kick it breakfast style. She sent me this inflatable unicorn horn for cats, which does specifically say in here that cats love it. And she also included a little note. And um, yeah, I can verify that cats do not love it because Joe's gonna show you the only pictures that we got. Okay, so picture of the box. First picture. <laughs> Second picture. <laughs> Third picture. And and then she broke free after that. So I would say she maybe did not like the inflatable unicorn horn. So maybe there won't be like a photo shoot with that. But uh, it was a very nice gift. Thank you very much, Amy, if you're watching this. And um, I hope she. I hope you get your Valentine's Day gift soon. This is Nutmeg. She really likes these boots. I have no idea why, but she likes to lay in them when she can. Nutmeg. Nutmeg! 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 Nope. Oh, apparently not. We decided to exchange gifts a little early. Yes, because we is, are impatient. <laughs> this is what I got for Joe. Mm -hmm. It's from the Brooklyn Brew Shop. It's a hard cider uh, brewing kit. I will put a link to it down below. I got it from Amazon in case you guys are interested in this. Yeah. But um, yeah, do you want to tell them? Uh, what we're gonna do? <laughs> we're gonna try to make some hard cider out of this. Thing. Yeah. So we bought a gallon of regular cider from our local farmers market. So we're gonna try to turn this into hard cider. Yeah. It should go pretty well. Yeah. Making hard cider doesn't seem too bad. Uh, the nice thing about the kit is that everything that you possibly need comes in those Except for boxes. the bottles and the caps and the cider. Yes. Yes. You still need, what was it? They actually said what they needed. Yeah, it's missing hard cider, oh, a funnel. And oh, we have a funnel. Bottles. Okay. okay, and we are just gonna use some beer bottles that we have and then just buy some more beer to drink and then we're gonna order the caps and the capper on Amazon. Yep. And then, this is the gift that Joe got me. This is the Lush set that I wanted called Rosie. And inside it has the, let's see if it'll focus. It has the Rose Jam Shower Gel, the Rose Jam Bubble Rune, which is like a bubble bar, the Rose Argan Body Conditioner, the Ultra Bomb Multi-Purpose Bomb, and another bubble bar. So I'm pretty excited to use this. I am waiting until Valentine's Day to actually open it though. We're now gonna show the traumatized cat after <laughs> After her inflatable unicorn horn, she's not very happy. Do you want to be petted? <gasps> no, no, she's gonna go in her box. She's like obsessed with this. Oh, no, no, she's not. She loves boxes. Like, they say cats love boxes. This cat loves, loves, loves boxes. She's hiding from us right now. That's her, her food corners over there, so she's just gonna eat her feelings, I think. <laughs> So what are you doing right now? Right now I'm just trying to sterilize all the equipment I'm going to be using. Uh, I got to keep everything clean so that way the hard cider actually tastes good. That's important. Yes it is. So next we have to boil the cider and then let it cool before putting it in the jug to ferment. We are making some chicken fajitas. Joe has been grilling up some peppers and onions and he just added in the chicken that's been marinating in this fajita sauce. Looks super good. I just made some guacamole and then we're also heating up some tortillas. And nutmeg is supervising from the loft stairs. So Joe is just getting the chicken into some small chunks and we're about ready to eat. And here are our finished products. They look really good. Those are Joe's and we're going to enjoy. So now Joe is ladling in the cider. It's cooled for a bit and there's some yeast and cider in this jug. Okay. 
So right now we got everything in here. We got the yeast inside of the cider. You can still see a little bit around the rim, unfortunately. We got it sealed with the cap, and then this little guy up on top is a uh, air seal. So this way, air can still get out, but nothing can. Get Happy out. Valentine's Day! Joe did a very good job, and he went out and got me roses while I was sleeping this morning, and he also got me my favorite, a Reese's Heart, and a box of chocolates with Ghirardelli squares. And now he is making us breakfast, and I am going to make us some mimosas. This is our favorite champagne or sparkling wine, and this is from Mum Winery in Napa. And we're also going to mix it with some berry juice to make some like festive Valentine's Day mimosas, I'm afraid. Alright. You're going to be fine. success. Yes. And then we're using some of this Berry Blast. I actually did a blog post on breakfast in bed ideas for Valentine's Day and I'm actually using one of the recipes that I found from Pinterest. And so we're just going to add a little bit of this to the sparkling rosé wine and it should be delicious. And we're finally getting to use this little topper that we actually bought from the winery in Napa from the Mum Winery to keep it nice and bubbly while you are um, like in between so yeah and then Joe's just making us some hash browns and some scrambled eggs and then we have our leftover scones from tea yesterday this is how bread shirt out we got our hash browns scrambled eggs this is my leftover scone from yesterday it is Nutella chocolate chip and Joe's is pumpkin with a caramel glaze we just warmed them up a little bit are you supervising me making lunch I just made Joe an acai bowl Mm -hmm. Here's your ass babe. <laughs> Thank you, baby. Doesn't it look good? It does. It looks delicious. That is a lot of granola. Well, it you like great. a lot of granola. <laughs> this is my acai bowl. The only difference is it has peanut butter on top instead of inside the actual, like, smoothie bowl part. 